5000 rpm so it will start and uh, we will see how the noise level is <laughs> go close to the pump where the noise should be higher so it's quite big There is a big improvement there. Hi all, welcome back to the shop. Uh, today I want to share with you a, con a concern I have with uh, this old CNC machine. Um, when the machine starts, the VFD send a signal to the cooling pump and also to the, to the spindle. But the noise <coughs> of the of the machine is very high, and it does not come from the, the spindle. So uh, what I want to do, uh, I want to make some uh, improvements regarding the noise that's coming from the uh, the pump. Uh, so the pump is uh, is set up underneath of the CNC. So it's the it's this one here and it was directly screw uh, on the bench on the CNC and I guess it's because it's directly screw on, on the bench of the CNC that the noise is higher than it should be so the first thing I, I want to, sh to share with you is the noise level so for that I need to make a setup and we will gauge the, the noise we have uh, with, with the form so let me do the setup and I'll be back in a couple of seconds. So the plan is the following. Uh, actually the pump is directly attached to the CNC table. And uh, that I want to change uh, is this direct link between the pump and the CNC table. So that I will uh, do is the following. I will put some uh, metal hooks inside the CNC tables. Uh, those one will be join by o-rings and then they will join also uh, a wood plate and the uh, and the pump would be uh, screw on the on these wood plates so uh, there will be no direct attachment and contact between the pump and the cnc table so uh, we can see what kind of improvement we can have on the noise and uh, i already prepared the stuff for that so <coughs> it is the the wood plates you can see here the o-rings uh, diameter is close to uh, one inch and uh, you can see also the four hooks um, so they will be joined in this way and uh, the hook will uh, keep the o-ring in, in this way so uh, let's do the modification uh, on the CNC and uh, we'll make new listing regarding the noise the way that we, we have and see if we can have some improvements because it's uh, very noisy and uh, it tires you uh, during all the day so maybe back in a while so I'm back I just finished the setup of uh, the the new support and uh, as you can see there is no direct attachment with the, the pump it is the black cylinder uh, to the CNC table so let's make a listing now to see if there is some improvement regarding the noise 
and uh, if there is any improvement, uh, what could be the value. So I put the nose, the nose gauge, so with no noise, we are close to 42. So let's start the CNC and see the figures. So we are here very close to the previous area and then we go in the front area to see if there is uh, good improvement. So let's put a spindle at the same speed. There is a big improvement there. And let's take the gauge. And I will put it in the front of the machine. So that was a big, big improvement. I will reduce the speed at 1000 RPM to see if there is a, a noise reduction on it. And now let's go to 10,000 RPM to see the noise. Now let's check at 15,000 RPM. And now let's go the max, the spindle, 24,000 RPM. It's a big improvement. What a big improvement. So let's go back to 5,000 RPM that we have at the beginning And let's check close to the pump. So now I guess we reduce the noise from the pump in a big way. Now 
very good result so here it is guys so if you have a noisy pump or something like that I show you that we can reduce the noise from a very very big improvement so thanks for watching and I uh, hope you like this episode and do not forget to, uh, to subscribe thanks you